Waitrose, they've been performing really well in recent years. Um, you could argue their performance, given the context of you know, reasonably tough times economically, the rise of the discounters, food deflation, has been particularly impressive. So what are they doing and what can we learn? Well, there's four things that I'd point to. The first one is about designing the store experience. So thinking of Waitrose specifically, what's different about their store experience? I'd say it's about calmness, and that's not an accident. It's designed, it's designed with lighting, it's designed with the use of space, also with the amount and the volume of messaging at point of sale. The second thing is product difference. So you probably can't be different everywhere, but you can choose a few places that matter and be different there. At Waitrose that's often about fresh food and particularly meat and fish. So what they've done with their meat and fish supply chain, not that easy, it's taken a lot of investment over quite a number of years, but you could argue the bigger the pain, the bigger the gain. And shoppers do cite it as a point of difference and one that matters. The third thing is about investing in people and treating your people well. So all the studies show this, happier people, happier staff, happier customers. Waitrose have the John Lewis partnership model, so it's not employees or staff with them, it is partners. Partners do share in the success of the business, they share in the profits of the business, they really care about the business. Shoppers notice that and notice great service. And then the fourth and final thing is about piling on the reasons to choose the shop or reasons to shop there. So I'm thinking here about free magazine when you spend a certain amount, free newspaper when you spend a certain amount, free cup of coffee, free parking often near the town centre. They may not sound like huge things, but particularly on smaller missions, the fresh top up, the meal for, for tonight, shoppers will often have many options. So that can be, and often is enough, just to sway the shopper towards visiting Waitrose rather than somewhere else.